For this first study, let's use C and G7 with a B base, and then we'll try A minor and E7. So for the C chord, what we're going to do is we're going to pluck all of the strings. We're using our thumb, our index finger, and our middle finger, these three fingers. And we're going to put the thumb on the A string, which is the fifth string up. Next, we're going to use our index finger on the B string, which is the second string up, and we're going to use our middle finger on the E string, which is the first string. And let's pluck it all at once. Now we can do the same thing with the A minor chord. So it doesn't matter which chord you use. First, let's start with the C chord. And then we're going to go to the G7 with the B bass and use the same fingers on the same strings. So this is what it looks like when we play C and G with the B bass. Now you can do that as many times as you want. You can just loop this over and over again as you're getting used to playing these strings. So as we're moving our thumb, we move it from the A string to the D string to the G string. Now you'll notice that my right hand is just closing, that's all it's doing. These knuckles right here, we're pulling from those knuckles. We don't have our, our wrist low. We don't put our pinky on the uh, guitar and try to pick like this or any other part. We're off the strings and this is a very natural hand position. The wrist is slightly bent. Let's do that same thing with the A minor chord and see what it sounds like. E7. So what I did here was I plucked the same strings as I did with a C and the G7 with the B bass, but just with the A minor. Carefully, see what we're doing here? We're actually setting our fingers on the strings. I call this set. And then we pluck the strings. And then we do something called relax. So set, pluck, relax, set, pluck, relax, set, pluck, relax, next string, set, pluck, relax, set, pluck, relax, E7, same string, A string, set, pluck, relax, set, pluck, relax, set, pluck, relax. So you need to practice this slowly so that you can understand how to do this and teach your hand what to do. Let's go back to A minor.